Strategic alignment is important. I think it's important for there to be alignment of organisational activities, that's policies, procedures and projects with organisational strategy. If there isn't alignment, why are those policies, procedures and projects in place? If there isn't alignment, what are they for? Could they actually be stopping the organisation from achieving its aims? If there isn't alignment, how is that motivating for the people applying those policies and procedures or working on those projects? I think it's important for everyone in an organisation to know the organisation's mission, that's what it exists for, the organisation's vision, where it wants to be, and the organisation's strategy, how it's going to get to where it wants to be. A portfolio or enterprise PMO can help to achieve alignment of projects with organisational strategy by making sure that each project has an approved business case before it starts and by checking regularly to make sure that the project is still on track to deliver that approved business case. This can get the PMO nicknames like the Project Prevention Police, but it's vital to ensure that the projects that get implemented are the ones that contribute to organisational strategy. There is a well-known story in which US President J.F. Kennedy is visiting NASA back in the 1960s. He introduces himself to a janitor and asks the janitor what he does there at NASA. The janitor responds by saying, I'm helping to put a man on the moon. By doing his job well, he was allowing the team to focus on the mission and not the mess. Can you imagine the current US President introducing himself to a janitor? Clearly at NASA they were doing something right because the janitor understood his contribution to the team and he felt involved and recognised. How can you get that sense of motivation if there is not a clear line of sight from the janitor to the moon landings or from policies, procedures and projects to organisational strategy? We will know we have succeeded with alignment when even the most junior person on a team or in an organisation associates themselves with and is motivated by the overarching mission of the team or organisation, so that's putting a man on a moon, and does not just see the task in front of them at that time, so clearing up a mess. On a project or programme team, that means everyone being aware of the business case and the reasons for the project's or programme's existence. If you're wondering why I'm sitting here talking to you about this, it's because I've worked on projects in organisations where this hasn't been the case, and believe me, it isn't pretty. How does your organisation ensure alignment of projects to organisational strategy? Let me know in the comments.